obviously, I mean, I, when all that was happening this morning, I was thinking to myself, there's no way that just falling on that concrete floor made her, I could have swore, like, the, the head, I, this has been going on. I, I don't understand. Have you seen her come to the house with bruises on her face? Yeah. Before the accident yesterday? Yes. So she had bruises on her face this week? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Where? Before she fell the train? Like one was like right here, and then she had one on her chin. It was one on the chin from when she fell on the those, that got worse. There was there was one on her chin before that, and then when she fell on the gravel. Like, so there's bruising before. Yeah, it got worse. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And Jeff, when she her heel of her boot mm -hmm. on the rock, and like, yeah, did she better tell me too? Okay. All right. Um, I don't want to. Do you want me to give him a call? No, I want to call my lawyer. I just. Uh, I'm completely, honestly telling the truth, and I would never lie. I don't, I mean, I wouldn't lie to anybody. Yeah. Now, if you want to call your lawyer, I mean, do you still want to talk to us? Yeah, I mean, I, I don't know if I want to. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. You're doing it. This is, this is what you're supposed to be doing, helping us. I'll do anything I can, do. I just, well, we do appreciate it. I, anything is going to be able to help us out with cannabis. You know, and I know that you want to do She's our main Jason in here. Jason, actually. 
We've got that one. I'm wasting it because they pop all the time. Jason Rush. So I see he sends you texts every morning. Yep. When he sends you these texts, like today he says, being ready to head over and you reply back, okay. How long does it take him to get over there after he sent that text? Five to ten minutes. He's okay. always late. So, so is that usually every morning, is it five to ten minutes before he gets there? All right. So. Well. So, I take that back. He's usually late, but if he's got to do a, get the truck ready and take it down, then he's on time. It just depends on if he's driving his own car or if he's taking the truck down. Because then he's got to load it. But this morning, when he said, you said he was probably five or ten minutes after, after that, which I get that. Yeah. So would you agree, on my watch right now, it is one o'clock. Mm -hmm. And would you agree that your phone says 1 o'clock? Yeah. All right. So if we go back to his text, would you agree that that says at 6.52 a.m. he's getting ready to head over? Mm -hmm. and you And he said, and you say okay, right? Yeah. At 6.52. Yeah. How long was she in the house? Not long. 30 seconds. And then 911 was called. Yeah, I called. Well, I called him first. But I wasn't really sure. You were good with Mac? Not really, no. All right. I'm going to try to help you out with, with, with time, with the clock. 6.52 a.m. So let's give him benefit of the doubt. 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. 7.02 a.m. Yeah. Or excuse me. Yes, 7.02 a.m. Yes. All right, 7.02 a.m. If it's 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. What do you think that 911 call was placed? I don't know. 820. Are you serious? One hour and 18 really? minutes later. Now, what you've done. That was bad. That is bad. What yeah. you've done is said he was there within. This happened within seconds of him being there, really and that did. child was there an hour and 20 minutes, giving him the benefit can of the doubt. Can I look at that real quick? I don't think you're right. Hold on, let me look at my time call. Let's, pull, let's, up my, pull up my calls real quick. Pull up my calls on the 911 was called. Because it was 720. Because I looked at the clock, it was that early. Go back to my call book. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. Yeah, 792 911 was called. I called 911 at 702 and hit at 701. Well, I'm looking at the camera report, Ronald. Yeah. I stand corrected. Yeah. You are right. I, I called right away. I'm like, there's no way that it was an hour. It was right away. I mean, it happened within seconds. <sighs> I'm telling the truth. I swear to God I am. I am not lying to you. I do not lie. I would not lie. I would lie. I just don't lie. All right. Hang time. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, you gotta keep jumping. Yeah. Um, just want to make sure that there's nothing else that stands out that you can think of. Um, any comments that have ever been made, you know, that you thought, whoa, you know, or his daughters, did they ever said anything? I don't. Yeah. I don't. I don't know that much. The little, the middle one. I don't. She doesn't talk to you much. No, they. She's. I mean, you can talk every weekend. Does he ever get through the week? Depending on if they're out of school or not. Like, okay. President's Day, I didn't have Hannah because Caitlin was off school the week after. Okay. So, and last week I didn't have her. I only had her Monday. Thursday was a rainy day. Okay. And I'll be using it on Friday. Right. And then the weekend he's off? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. How's her uh, relationship with her sisters? I think she's the one that aggravates. <laughs> oh, I heard, you know what I mean? Yeah. You said she's very focused. <laughs> Does she jump like all the time on the yeah. furniture? Yeah. So she, yeah. How does she do when you just want her? Like if you put her time out, does she sit or is she going to jump around? She sits. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 
Uh, and then today's date is uh, 3 9 18. And it's 10 05 a.m. 10 05? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Right. Um, like I said, we're trying to fill in some blanks. Yeah. Okay? yeah. Um, a lot of stuff I'm unanswered. Yeah. Uh, a lot of questions. Uh, appreciate you coming down and talking about that. So, how long have you been at New Ashley Mason in Hannah? I think it was like the middle of June when okay. we started working in Horse Court. He wasn't living next door yet, the house wasn't empty yet. But it was a Sunday night, and TJ, we were watching TV, and he looked at me and he's like, oh, by the way, we hired a new mechanic, and can you watch his kid tomorrow? He has another babysitter. <laughs> I'm like, sure. And he's like, oh, I got another thing, he'll be here an hour earlier than you early yet. I'm like, great. Oh, wow. Yeah. So. Okay. Um, okay, that's from on you. Yeah, that's from on me. Um, and then, you know, she fit in great with another girl. So, mm -hmm. I mean, she fit in great on four. Well, and actually, the four worked out better than three because then there weren't leaving anybody out right, or anything. Right. Actually, the four worked out really great. Um, so, you got Savannah and Vivian. And then Hannah is Jason. next door. Yes. Jason. Who's the fourth one? Kaylin is her name. Yeah. And Okay. And I only have her Monday through Wednesday. Her okay. dad works for Time Warner, so he has Thursdays and Fridays on. Okay. So it started off just like my part time, like little extra money okay. gig. Yeah. But it's trying to, I mean, and I love it. I love babysitting. Yeah. I really do. And you guys converted that, it was a garage. And yeah. You converted it to like yeah. a playroom, yeah. nursery kind of thing. Okay. Just because it's been cold. Yeah. And the, and honestly, the wind at our house, the way it comes over the valley is so strong. Like yeah. even on a nice day, sometimes it's still chilly and mm -hmm. they only about five with you. Right. So. so what, um, you pretty much take care of Hannah the same way you do as Vivian and Samantha? They just I mean, they all fit into, yeah, I mean, they're, they're she's, like, they're like, Hannah's three. She just turned three January 11th. Okay. So I didn't have her for a couple weeks over Christmas and all that snow and it didn't work. Okay. So I mean, for like three weeks I didn't have her over Christmas. Okay. Yeah. Were you paid? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What do you get paid? 30 bucks an hour. Or 30. I wish. 30 bucks a day. <laughs> 30 bucks a day. And if it's over 12 hours, like sometimes they work okay. 7 to 7, yeah. um, he'll give me 35. Okay. It's kind of okay. like a longer day or whatever. Okay. But 30. Because okay. I provide the food. The How other girl work? brings her food, so it's 25. Oh, okay. I don't have to feed her. Her mom sends her a lunch bag and juices. So, so Hannah's dad does construction, so he almost assume he gets up early. Yeah, he's usually by my house by 7, between 6 30 and 7 every day. Okay. Yeah. Just depending on if he drives his own car, because they work most of the time, I think most of their contracts are in Northern Kentucky. So I know he drives to Alexandria every day. Oh, okay. So if he's taking a work truck and loading it up, it's usually earlier than if he's driving yeah. in a car and doesn't have to do any of that. Nonsense. What's a typical day? Like how long? Ten hours, so long. Hours. Yeah, I mean, because he's driving an hour. So oh, we're talking. Yeah, he gets off at five okay. usually, unless they have like a. So we're talking breakfast to dinner time. Yeah. Oh okay. yeah. You feeding three meals a day? Yeah, usually, two, unless he gets there at five. I usually we usually eat at six thirty because TJ's always late. Um, yeah. So we have afternoon staff at four thirty. Um, yeah, I try to time it like a daycare or yeah. preschool, you know, yeah. I mean, I taught preschool or daycare or did that. That's run efficient. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, I do try to like, and we do lessons and we do flash cards and like, okay. you know, try to make it as structured as possible. But I let them play for, I mean, I let, so just, that's what I was taught in school, <laughs> to let them play. That's how they learn. Yeah. So, we play most of the day, unless we have an outing. I always do pass. Um, I wanted to get a museum pass, but it's not finished yet, so I don't yeah, know. Right, yeah. I'm kind of yeah. to do that. We do the zoo a lot once it gets warm. Okay. Um, one other thing. We go to Costco. <laughs> okay, that's good. Well, it's fine because we yeah. get, you know, it's inside, and I get to shop it on, and I get a treat, but I don't want to get to sleep. And the pizzas, have you ever had a Costco pizza? Uh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Yes. Just go ahead and pizza. Yeah. <laughs> That's what we did on Savannah's birthday. She's a Halloween baby, and it was cold. And I'm like, I don't know where to do. We took baby into the zoo. It was a little bit warmer in September. I'm like, I don't know what to do for something. And we went to Costco. I just got yelled at. You, is your cell phone on? Yeah, probably. I just got that. My cell phone's on, too. I'm not supposed to have it. What's the worst? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. 
Perfect. And now I, I got trouble too. We have to have a Yeah, because of our dispatch. Single here? You get on a plane, you know, you're supposed to turn around. Oh, nice. Just in case it's it's everybody. You use the same. Yeah. I did not know that. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> and what do Things. One of the many things we have to try to remember when we're doing yeah. else we're doing. But, um, yeah, so Costco. Um, yeah. we just, I try and, to get them out of the house yeah. as much as possible when it's not freezing cold. Okay. Any, um, I mean, that's 12 hours. You're, you're basically going to 12 hours. Are you doing like baths for everybody? Or is there yeah, like, it On um, Mondays we go to dance, so yeah. usually everybody gets a dance, a dance bath. Yeah. Um, I don't give Hannah a bath like every day. Yeah. Um, and sometimes Christine will even say, Kayla, I'm like, can you get a bath last night? You might give her one today. Yeah. Things like that. But no, I mean, I'm not giving. So, and a lot of the times, like, my kids get a bath later at night if I didn't do that during the day. And yeah. I try to take a shower real quick while they're happy. Yeah, whenever you can. That's pretty yeah. much how it works. Or I take one at night with my girls in the shower with me. Okay. So when when's the last time you have given Hannah a bath? Uh, last week, last probably week. last Monday. Yeah, because she cause she came Monday and had, he said I gave her a bath last week. So Monday we didn't. This Monday we didn't get bath. Okay. Yeah. And then you don't have you have her on the weekends at all? No. Nothing. And Saturday I didn't have her on sometimes I don't even have her on Thursday. Like if it's a rain day or like the last two Thursdays I haven't had her. I just had her Monday through Wednesday. Okay. Okay. If um, you had a rain day or something. Is she like a, is she bashful guy? She did like. So you she like she isn't with kind of, me, no. It's just individually. Well, you know, I take that back. I do. If I let her play, yeah. Not individually, I'll do like two at a time. Yeah. Like, yeah. Two, like, sit in the bathroom. Right, 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 right. But I have to put them all four in there and let play. Yeah. That's not often, but it's okay. like a lot. Is, is she okay with me? She is okay awesome with me, but like if TJ or somebody else, well, she kind of, she'll get right, yeah. But she's not, I mean, no. She's, okay. She plays, she talks to me. Okay. I, she's. Do you, My little buddy. Yeah. Do you like, washcloth, scrub, you know, head to toe? How, how does that go? Yeah, I mean, I mean obviously. I, yeah. Just especially asking. if they're dirty. Right. I mean, I'm fine with farm. So you're like, you're moving arms. And, oh, yeah. And oh, yeah. Scrub, yeah. Scrub, scrub, oh, yeah. I definitely get the washcloth. Okay. Yeah. Oh, God, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. Um, have you ever noticed anything, any bruising or anything on her? When you were doing baths? No, just okay. from, I mean, normal things like Bruce and Mike it's had on their legs yeah. or falling on their, I mean, yeah. not, I've never, no, I've never not noticed okay. anything. And she's never acted weird towards her dad either. He walks okay. in the door and she runs up to him. And, okay. Daddy! Yeah. And then every morning she asks him, are you, you coming back? Kayla even asked her mom still. I've had Kayla for two years. Mom, you come back and get me today? Yeah. Okay. Yes, every day. <laughs> Is there anybody else that watches Hannah? Um, I think there's another lady on Fridays, but most of the time he doesn't work on Fridays. I okay. think they try to get their 40 in, okay. unless they've got an emergency or he's helping yeah. somewhere else. I think okay. her name's Sandy, but I think she has her here and there. Okay. Yeah. And I don't know her. I've never met, I don't, I've never met her. I think he's, she's just a family friend that just mm -hmm. had a baby and is at home, and she's backed up. Yeah. Yeah. So... Do you, do you, do you get, does she change clothes often during the day? Does she get dirty and you change them? Does, no. Does she keep changes of clothes there or anything? No, I actually have the baby to talk to him about yeah. that. Okay. Because if she does get dirty or something on her or has a pee accident, I just put her on clothes, obviously. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, but that doesn't happen often either. I mean, she's had a couple pee accidents, but she's three. Yeah. Yeah. I thought he trained all three of them last summer. So, Kaylin, Vivian, and Hannah. All last summer, I spent it after. Oh, I yeah, that's, all a, three that's a tough job. Yeah. Um, so now I'm like, so now you can wait. I'm just kidding. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, is there, like, okay, so like specifically, um, you said it was the last Monday that you would have given Hannah okay. a bath, mm -hmm. and you didn't notice no. nothing. No, not at all. We're married. My Vivian is bruised all over her and from falling. She's a kamikaze. Yeah. Yeah, you know, and Savannah. I got to take that in the morning. Yeah, right? I mean, they're just wild. Yeah, Hannah is more wild than that. Okay. She is, she has a dad. That's all she has. So, yeah. like, when I see, so the difference, this is where I see the difference. When TJ gets home, 
It's that this morning times a million. Right, yeah. Because they, they haven't seen him. He's the fun guy. I'm not the fun guy. Right. <laughs> you know, and I feel like that's the kind of the way it is with her and him. Mm-hmm. Like, and I don't think that he neglects her or leaves her alone. I just think that she gets into things and does things that she's, yeah. she knows that she's probably. See, you told me the other day that she'll, like, so I guess the lock's in their house. He will lock from the inside, and so I guess she locked it shut through. Said, "Dad, you can't get your room now." You know what I mean? Like things yeah. like that. How does it, like if she does do something? How does that go? Like who is there a timeout chair? Yes. Okay. Both those rockers in my living room. That has a name on them. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, those are timeout chairs. And I've made I don't I don't know if I ever made hands with her nose in the corner, but I make my hands look her nose in the yeah. corner, especially if they like hit or something mm-hmm. that's really bad. But you don't just sit and look at it right. You're gonna go. Okay. Think about what you did. Um, has Hannah ever? Is there anything that sticks out in your head where she's acted out recently? No. Nothing. She doesn't. She. I'm not her mom. Like I'm. You know what I mean? Kaylin. You live twelve hours a day. Right. No, but I feel like Kaylin and her listen way better than mine. Okay. If that makes sense. Yeah. Hannah and Kaylin listen. Okay, buddy. Yeah. I'll say, okay, you two go stay with the door. Look. Why not? You're ready to go. You know, of course they're right by the door. Mine are like running around like that this morning. Okay. So she pretty much always. Now, I mean, they'll do things and like give each other Barbie or something, and I'll be like, "You're ready to go?" Yeah. Okay. I mean, they're kids. They do hate each other, and they do. You said a little boy said yesterday that um, she fell on some gravel. She did Tuesday. It was the nice day. We went outside, and so so you know you know you're very aware of uh, some bruises. Oh yeah, yeah. I look like pebble bruises from when she fell. She literally so she had on um, cowboy boots with the heels. Yeah. And Vivian took off running, and I was kind of behind them. Um, far behind them. I should have been up closer. We'll we'll we'll, we'll get into all that. Okay. Here. We're going to show you some pictures. Okay. But uh, so we just kind of want you to point out okay. all the bruises and all the okay. small little nicks and scratches that you were aware of gotcha. and exactly how they have it okay. and all that stuff. Okay. Okay. Yes. I thought of you okay. um, that may or may not be easy to look at. You know. okay. Just start off just to give you a, with the pebbles that you were talking about when she fell. Okay. It's, it's not pebbles. I mean, it's a gravel driveway. Like, right. It's not pebbles. It's, okay. TJ just redid it and it's, I mean, it's rocks. It's rocks. Yeah, it's rocks. It's not pebbles. Okay. <laughs> yep. Exactly where she fell and on her chin. She didn't even her hand didn't even hit. Like she just she what she was doing, and I can show you how she was running. Running like this, and then looked back and went like that. Literally. Did she slide? Or no. It was just bam. Bam. Yeah. She did and she got right back up and kept running. I said, Hey, are you okay? I'm okay. So so all these so all these small little bruises. And the ones on the chin. Yes, I know about those right there. And even yes. the one on the yes, chin. Yes, I remember the one on the chin, yep. And the neck there. Yep. Yep, that's, that's all this. That's from that. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. I saw, saw it. I mean, the neck too is. Yes. Up under her chin like that. So. She, well, she would have extended pretty far. She, did, she went like that. Yeah. Okay. okay. And on the toilet yesterday, not yesterday, I, Wednesday, I noticed. That I was like, wow, man, those rocks got you. And I even told him that. I said, the rocks look like they pump, like pumped her chest. Yeah. Okay. And they're big rocks. So what me. was she wearing shirt-wise when that happened? She just had on a regular shirt. It was like a t-shirt. Um, oh, no, just a long sleeve, like cotton. Long <laughs> sleeve t-shirt. Yeah. Um, yeah. It was warm. Okay. It was yeah. like 65. Okay. Yeah. Now is that uh, we may have a better one of uh, the shoulder? The shoulder. Yeah, not seeing that one. That okay. might be from the choo choo train fall or something, but I don't see that one now. Okay. We have that looks like a hint. That's the shorter one. But you can kind of see that, and you're saying that that's not. No, I don't think. I don't know. No, I don't think that's part of it. Unless I just didn't notice it when I. I because when I noticed the bruise on her neck and her chest, we were going potty. Okay. And what day did this happen? Tuesday. Okay. This uh, this week. Yes. Okay. Tuesday. When it was nice out. It was. Is that the same day? Yeah, as... 11. 
Yeah. So the tra- I didn't actually see the train. I haven't seen the train. How tall is the train? Uh, about that high off the ground. Okay. She was standing up on it. Yeah. Doing the surfing thing. Yeah. And it went out from the side and she went down like that. With, I mean, her arms back. Yeah. Yeah. And, and smacked. So I'm the right side of the train. Yeah. Okay. And I freaked out. And ran out there and I'm like, are you okay? She jumped back up and I, she said, yeah, I'm fine. I said, let's go put ice on it. Let's sit down really far. What was she complaining of? Headache. Her head hurt. Okay. Her head hurt. Okay. I gave her some ibuprofen, but I, I brought a soft ice pack in the freezer for the, we gave her washcloths already. Was well, any of the other kids around when she did that? Or? Yeah, they were all in the garage playing. Okay. Yeah, they were all there right in there. Okay. Like, so it was in the garage and she fell. Yeah, it was a concrete floor. Okay. I'm in the rubber, rubber pad the house. Yeah. Um, so when you're, you said you put ice after she fell off the train. Mm-hmm. Now, where did you, where did you apply the ice? On her face. Yeah. Where she fell. Okay. Yeah. So it's like one. Just day. just where on her face? Like was it one spot, a couple spots? Well, where she spot? smacked it, like on her eye yeah. and her she cheekbone. She wasn't about her eyes. Or just about her eyes? <laughs> I asked her if her eye hurt because I could tell if something hit it right inside there. And I said, does your eye hurt? And she said, no. She said, just my head. So I gave her some ibuprofen. We sat down. She played with Barbies the rest of the day. We had snack and five. We were going to do snack. I was getting snack ready. And because it was like 4 o'clock. And I let him play out. We were going to have snack outside in the garage. And then when that happened, I was like, no, we're just come back inside. We'll put the cars away. Well, I came back in the living room. They got the Barbies out and baby dolls. And we were playing. I put on Leap, the Bellarmino movie. That was it. She ate two bowls of Skyline. I made a Skyline chili bake. She ate two bowls of Skyline chili. She's a great What kind of ice was it in a, like, is it black No, no, the, the, the blue packs, the blue oh, soft the packs. Pack. Yeah, the ones so that are soft. So that was yeah. Wednesday after she fell off the train, she was eating normal. Yeah, she ate two big bowls of Skyline chili bake. That's good. And crackers. And then he said she ate again when they got home. Okay, perfect. Yeah, kids eating. She yeah, ate. Crying. She didn't throw up. I looked at her pupils. I I always do the lap the flashlight and the pupils. Yeah. My brother was a soccer player, so all my life I was on concussions. What, yeah, so what, her eyes are pupils. What are you looking for when you're shining the light? If they get smaller or bigger. Yeah. And if they're moving. And both were doing that. Both of them were doing that. Yeah. And my tracking okay. My, yeah, so I am a worry war. My mom. So, so, um, do you have any like training in that or? No. Okay. Just Google. No, I didn't even Google anything. My brother's a soccer player, and he's the one that would run towards the ball instead of not trying to get hurt. Yeah. And I remember him getting hit with the ball in the eye at close range once, and yeah. left. No, you don't. You don't have to be a doctor to see if no, people are. Well, I think I can tell when people are. Right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, I mean, I definitely checked her out. And, so he walked in the door and said, well, she had an accident, she fell in the garage and smacked her face. And he's like, oh, well, you are, you know, you are swollen up a little bit. I said, put ice on it. You can probably get her side of the before she goes to bed. Yeah. yeah. So it was, you said, you know, you saw something in her. I noticed her eye. Her right eye. Mm-hmm. And then what else other than, well, I, I, I thought she hit her. Either. Cheek, well, it was mostly right here, like okay. the cheekbone, almost. Okay. So I thought, like, it had got her cheekbone. So I was kind of, like, making sure she was okay. And I, she complained about anything else that I know than it is? Not anything. She didn't point to anything? Not a thing. She wasn't pulling on anything or rubbing anything else? No. Okay. No. Good. All right, we're going to move on and show you um, a few more. Kind of explain Yeah. That. So this is her left cheek? Yeah. I feel like she was so, when she walked in the front, front door, when she walked in the back door, the garage door, into the back of the house. When is this? Thursday. Thursday. She gave her bed? And I don't, I've never seen that before, so I don't know. But I feel like, because the way she, when she looked up at me and said, buddy, can I have Jenna? and couch and went to take her jacket off and she fell, she fell on that side, the other side, and it was, there was like a, a pink cart laying there, and I think she scraped her face on that, but I'm not sure. When, I, she, when she fell unconscious? Yes, when okay. she collapsed in front of me, yes. Okay. Yes. But I... I she wasn't on top of anything, she was walking. Well, so what happened, so say this is the door, yeah. she walks right here, there was like, um, you know one of those 
push cart that you can like serve things off of. Mm -hmm. It's like a sure. bar cart. Yeah. yeah. And she fell like that, and she there was a wheel. I think mm -hmm. I think she hit that. Okay. But, but I don't she know wasn't that. on top of anything. Yeah. She wasn't climbing or nothing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. she was yeah, she literally just collapsed in front of me. Okay. Just. Did you notice the ear as well? No. Her hair's all over her. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you have the ear here, and you have the back of her ear here. here. Um, I don't know. I mean, that's, you know, this is bruised on both sides. Yeah. Hmm. Um, there's a piece of cartilage in the ear. So, um, you know, this is a one continuous bruise, basically. Yeah. So it's, you know, it's two bruises. It is a bruise through. It's, it's something on the front and the back. Hmm. It's like. Yeah, I've never, never seen her. that. Never noticed her ears. What about that? A little scratch. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, and she won't let me fix her hair or with her hair. And by like you do a little bit, she takes it out. I've, I've never. Okay. And her hair's always like. Okay. No, I've never noticed this. But I feel like that was from collapsing. Okay. But I'm not. I'm not sure. So after she fell. Um, she fell face first, correct? Off the choo-choo train? <laughs> no, uh, Thursday when she fell, when she went unconscious. Yes. Um, what exactly? How did you move her, and into what position did you move her? I really wasn't sure what was happening, so I kind of picked her up, and I was like, "Hannah, are you okay?" And I probably did the wrong thing because I wasn't sure what was happening. At it. <coughs> what's wrong? What's wrong? Wake up! Like, what's what's going on with you? So you down? I had been down. Yeah, and I'm like, well, first I said, "Hannah, are you okay? Get up." I thought maybe she'd like tripped over her pants or something, because sometimes she'll try to like take off her shoes while she's standing up. Yeah. And she didn't get up, and I'm like, are you okay with up? And she was like not saying anything to me. And so I picked her up, and I'm like, you know, I probably shook her. Like, are you okay? And I shouldn't have done that. I don't know. What, what you know? I don't know if I shook her. I just was like, I was holding her. Like, Hannah, are you okay? And then so I laid her down, and that's when I called Jason. And I said, Jason, she's, there's something wrong with Hannah. She's not waking up. I don't know what happened. She just, started, she just walked into her and collapsed. I said, you need to come up here now. So you, were you holding her at yes. that time? Well, no, I was. You were there on the Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. So so down. I wasn't holding her very long, but like okay. I didn't understand why she wasn't coming to. Like, yeah. And you're, you're shaking her to get her to come to. How are you shaking her? Not shaking her. Just like, Hannah, are you okay? Hannah, are you okay? Hannah, are you okay? Trying like, to wake her? Okay. So yeah. you... When you're down, you were down on one knee, two knees, over top of her. Yeah, I mean, I was down, yeah. You had both arms under her, or did, we, did you have her shoulders? Well, when, no, when I was holding her, I was holding her like this, and when I laid her down, I wasn't holding her all, I was on the phone. Yeah. And then when I got fell on you, I was like, I don't even know what I was doing, to be honest. And then what he got there, gasping for air. Like how often? And I would say, every couple seconds, and I, when I would say her name, she would look at me. She was she was responding to me. I just couldn't get her to like say anything. And then Jason got there and picked her up off my floor and took her out to the couch in the garage and laid her there and waited for the paramedics to come around the back. Yeah. I noticed her eye. Okay. Yep, I noticed her eye Thursday. So Thursday morning. Yep. She walks in. I noticed that. Yep. Um, so the eye that you were, oh, you know, it's her eye, right? yeah. yeah. It is her eye, that's the, I mean, she fell on her face on the side of the yeah. choo-choo train. I'm not, the pictures and mirroring is not good for me. Well, that's how she would be looking at it, yeah. But that's, if you were, if you were, if you were to put nice on her face, obviously. It was, yeah, it was the left side, I'm sorry, yeah, okay. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm still okay. like, yeah. So, so when she fell off the train, Yes, she, she did. Hit, yep. She hit her face. Yep. Now you're saying that it's the left side. Of yeah, her. I was thinking because she fell. She fell to the left. I don't know why. Not, not, the, not the right. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. Right, so I've never been good. Ross right, Ross left. <laughs> this you did not see. Not that I know of. Train. No. Okay. But I could be wrong. I don't know. I didn't think she was hurt. Right. Like this. Mm 
on the, when she got off the train. Yeah, but I didn't think that she was like... She wasn't thrown up. No! She wasn't her pupils were like, she ate two bowls of Skyline. She, she didn't throw, throw any Not up. any of it. And then you didn't hear her dad never said anything about it. Not her. one word. And he walked in while she was eating Skyline. Yeah. Yeah, it's heavy. So yeah, heavy that, food. She left Wednesday. I honestly don't know about that. But I, she left the house, your house Wednesday with her eyes starting to black at all? Yeah. Yeah. Where did you first notice? Just right here. And then um, I noticed that she had like a little icky looking thing on her eye. Okay. Yeah. And then when she came and in there, I was like, oh, it's starting to get black. And you told Dad? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. So, oh, yeah. so Wednesday. I usually call him during the day. It's some, like I've had once before. Like, so Thursday, a long time ago. We saw, saw her. This was, it was a dramatic um, worsening of the injury, right? What day? Thursday. Yeah. Thursday morning, because this would have been the but day after she. Honestly, when she walked in Thursday morning, and when he put her down, I like looked at her face. I thought she looked better. Oh, okay. And I said, um, after I put the ice on, I googled bruising, um, how to make it feel better or get better, and it said to put vapor rub, we'll cool it down, and salt will help break up the red blood cells. And when did you Google that? Wednesday or Thursday? Wednesday after it happened. What did you? What were you on when you Google that? My Google app. My phone. My Google app. Yeah. Um. So it said, Vicks vapor rub and salt. And so I put that on there. So when you walk in, I was like, sorry, she smells like Vicks Vicks vapor rub. Um. And so I, when she walked, when she came Thursday, I was like, oh, it, it seems like it worked a little bit. Mm-hmm. I thought she looked better. Okay. So where was the bruising again on Wednesday that you noticed before you sent her home? Under the eye and on the cheekbone. And, her and, eye and in her eye, yes. Okay, yes. So none of this up here or over here is quite there. Not yet, no, okay. no. All right. No. There may be in the line there already, but sh- I wouldn't have been a, a prize for opening. You know, I don't know that I noticed that, but I, yeah, I definitely saw that and I saw the inside of the eye. Okay. So when, when none of the, you, you were saying the right side, none of this was on her right side from the train. You're saying no, that's from the gravel. Okay. She literally bit it. Okay. Full force running. Did she run fast or? She tries. She yeah. Vivian was the leader in that. Okay. She took off running and Hannah followed her. You said when she totally bit it, her head was going down towards the ground. Yeah, she smacked her chin. Her chin right here? Yeah. Okay. And that's a problem. There's no more directly on the point of her chin. We're looking There's very, very little to no bruising right here in the middle. It's on the left. Yeah. yeah. Like I said, I was far away too. I was way right behind them, so. And then up underneath. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So when people, so when people fall, um, you're gonna have bruising on the sharp points. Okay. No. So it's gonna be this point, none here, and then some here. Or if you're over here, you're gonna have some here. And she could. Have. I don't know. I honestly, I was here. just coming out the door and then fall. Straight forward. Mm-hmm. You're not gonna have. Bruising over here and over here and none in the middle. Yeah. And then bruising would have been here and up underneath there, there would have been no bruising. That's a soft spot that your natural, your body naturally protects. Yeah. The way your body. That's why it's tucked in. Why it's tucked in. And that's what that's where we're getting. That's why we wanted you to come down and fill in some of these holes. Yeah. Um, because, I mean, honestly, I've been pretty honest with you this morning. A lot of these aren't added up to a fall on the gravel. Yeah. With with it being over here mm-hmm. and down here, and then these, I mean, she would have had to fall in, like in some perfectly aligned gravel to get. And, and here, here's another thing on the uh, on the chest. Once again, you don't have to be a doctor. You've got to be a yeah. like that. Okay. You see that bruise? Mm-hmm. What's that kind of look like? Is it older? Older. Yeah. If older is older, there's some yellowing all through here, and then see this here? Mm-hmm. That looks, what would you say? Older. To me, that looks brand new. Yeah. Oh, okay. That, that is know. newer than even. Okay, new. yeah, yeah, I don't know. So, what it kind of looks like is that these are all from a different time. Yeah, and like I said, she is well, she is well. I don't, I don't think that she's been, I really don't think that she's been hurt. I, you know. No, I honestly don't. In my 
gut intuition, I don't think that he's a bad guy. I really don't. I think that he well, is a here, here's, guy. One, here's one thing that we, that, um, uh, this is from a senior neurologist. Okay? Yeah. He's telling us that uh, the, the brain injury that she s sustained was absolutely not 24 hours prior or even an hour prior. The injury that caused this, uh, or the incident that caused this brain injury, yeah. was immediate. That is, I have no idea. So she wouldn't have, so, so um, if dad would have, I don't know, knocked her out Thursday morning before she dropped you off, let me ask you this, was she crying or anything like that? No, but she, she didn't want to kind of like let him, that she was, she didn't want to let him go? Yeah, a little. Okay. Yeah. She kept wanting to hug on to him. Yeah, but she wanted donuts. But she, yeah. Well, we got him fine. Yeah. Okay. So whatever happened prior to getting to your house? Okay. I don't know what I mean. It wasn't Thursday and it wasn't Wednesday for sure. Yeah. Um, you know, we've got we've got these world-renowned neurologists mm -hmm. saying, no, this didn't happen Thursday. It surely didn't happen Wednesday. That's this right. happened immediately. This injury happened, and she went down. She literally walked. And that's what these down. people do. Obviously. Yeah. No. I. I. I yeah. No. I. I told you we're throwing. we what we know. What we know from yesterday. Everything we know. We were telling the doctors this is what we're being told. Doctor says, nah. It was a hit. He's seen thousands of yeah. these. He said, Doctor says it was a hit, and she went down. I would never hit a kid. I think okay. I, I, I don't even think my own. Someone in that house, oh, I, I'm going to be completely honest with you. Someone in that house, after dad dropped her off, injured this kid to the point where she's unconscious. Or a dramatic fall, or something, so, or some sort of accident. No, I mean, I believe you, but that an accidental happened drop, morning. yeah, something, no, something no, absolutely happened, happened, happened yeah. while when she walked in the door to the time she fell. That's the time frame that there's no doubt. It's not a question of well, maybe it happened. Yeah. Maybe, then there's no doubt. It absolutely happened during this time, and the only person that was there. A couple of kids and you. Yeah. That's what we're running into. So, I, you know, we can understand if God, I can't, I cannot imagine. I've got kids similar, similar ages. Yeah. All these kids. Yeah. You know, I, I can't imagine if if I would have asked, accidentally done something to cause this. Yeah. I. And, and then, you know, I mean, and I, it's, yeah, it's, it's human nature. It's yeah. Human nature no. To, if I to, hurt to anybody, just, I would. Right, listen now. It's completely human nature to, you know, this is a big deal, obviously. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's human nature to be like, I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. What, what do you do? I really I'm don't. I, that, I'm, Whether it was an accident or not, yeah. something happened under your care in about a five-minute span. We've absolutely got to narrow down to that. And by you saying, that's kind of not cutting it because... I know, I, but I don't know what else to say. And I think, I mean, you called for help. Yeah, of course. So it's not like you were trying to hide anything. No, I don't so Something, not, something not. happened. Something happened, okay? Um, something happened that we're, that we're not getting told. Well, see, yeah, we're, we're not, it's not, it's not if something happened. Something happened. So we're beyond nothing happened. Yeah. We're beyond that. Something happened. And the only person who knows what happened yeah. is you. Um, I, unfortunately, she, you know, I don't. she can't tell us right now. No, I know. No, she can't. Um, so that's what we're So we're, 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 we're beyond, we're beyond, no, no, listen, no, listen, we're beyond that. Yeah. No, it's okay, I, I understand what you're there's saying. There's no point talking about Wednesday, okay, because Wednesday absolutely did not happen. Anything Wednesday. This happened in about a five minute span, okay, yeah. Yeah. and it happened when she was in your custody, okay. 
Was it an accident? I mean, some, she, 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 she's done something. She's fallen. She's, she she's been mean, dropped. Something. I did not do anything to her. But we're not saying you did anything. <laughs> no, I know. But no, I honestly, she did. But we're just saying you know. Okay? I mean, you would, you would have seen her, you saw her collapse. It was immediate that she collapsed yes, after this. I mean, you, 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 said you, you said you, you never lost eye contact with her. With, with the time she walked in, yeah. you followed her in, and she collapsed. That's not possible. That's not that's not possible. I believe she walked in. Yeah, she did. By then, yeah. I believe all that. But as soon as you guys went into the house, something happened. There's no doubt. Just listen to me. Listen. To me. I know. There's no doubt that something happened. Something absolutely happened. Okay. We're not going back to Wednesday. We're not going back to the morning that Dad had her. We're beyond even that. We've it's narrowed down by by brain surgeons that, no, that it happened right when right before she hit the ground. That's that's when it happened. And you just told us and you told us several times that she you were looking at her. It's not like she walked around the corner and you came around and was like, what the hell happened? No, she you had eye contact with her the yes, whole sir. time. Yes, sir. But that something caused her to collapse. She didn't just collapse. Traumatic brain injury. That's what this is. Traumatic. Okay. You called for help. Yes. Okay. So. As soon as she. As soon as, soon as, as she there's, there's, no, there's no doubt in our minds that this was an accident. Yeah. This is a horrible, horrible she accident. All Thursday morning. That that's this is a horrible accident. I asked. And you have to tell us. Listen to me. Listen. Listen. And you have to tell us yeah. exactly what that accident was. Yes. Because her, her, she's still being treated, okay? Now, your treatment can go either way. Whether she's hit the back of the head with a baseball bat, which I absolutely don't believe she was. Or whether she was dropped, or, or whatever she hit her head on, or, or got some sort of whiplash somehow. It was instant. It was absolutely I instant. You. So, and if you believe that it's instant, you're, you're agreeing that, okay, she fell because she got hit, or something happened, something caused, look, something caused this, okay, in her head. She fell because of that, all right? What caused that? What accident caused this? She fell on the door and hit the concrete step. She when? Went Thursday morning. Walking into the yeah. walking into the house. Yes. Tell us about. It. Take us through it. Details. So when I opened up the door, she was coming through, and she slipped on that concrete step in the metal part. She hit the metal part on her eye. Which door? The, the that one. Door yeah, into the yeah house. going into the house, the carpet. And so I got her back up, and she stood up and looked up at me and did say, "I want donut and couch," and then collapsed. Appreciate you being honest. Yeah. I mean, you know, it's an, it's an accident. You called for help. This is my fault. You I should have protected her. Not, it's not I should have let her fall. I should have been holding her. It's not your fault. But here's the thing. You've gone through every single one of these injuries, and you had no problems telling us about these. Okay. okay. I thought you was and even the injury, even the even the injury that that you were thinking, uh, put her in the situation she was in. You told us about that. No problem. What's the difference? What's the difference in this injury I, and the one you were there for both I of know, them? If you like, thought this one put her in the hospital, I didn't. I thought Wednesday. I didn't. I thought Wednesday because she's not. Yeah, you went over this still. One. You're under you your own this one. You yeah. said this one had a little more water. Okay. You why called I for help. Know. Why lie about this one? About about her falling? Because I thought it was because I. I thought it was my fault, and I thought she was having a seizure, and I didn't want Jason to be mad at me, that she slipped and fell when I wasn't holding her, and I was trying to grab her blanket from her. Here's, here's the thing. And I thought it was my here's, fault that she was having a seizure. I thought she was having a seizure. I was scooping up her mouth. Okay. So she's, so go through that again. Go, go through that again. I opened up the door. I'm like, can I go out and take your jacket or blanket? And when I went to take her blanket, she it slipped on the blanket, got underneath her foot, and on that one step, and she hit that metal part. 
the, on the threshold in the bottom of the door? Yeah, the middle part that goes. Okay. Across. And she hit what side? The left side. Okay. Um, she, right. Okay, she's what, this tall? Yeah. Okay, that's yeah. not what did this. So this, this. She's this tall, right? No. Oh, this tall. No. She's, she's this tall. Yeah. And the steps are. She's she's the step back. She really did hit the, hit okay. the middle part. So there's, is there a step and then you step into the house? Yes. So she okay. hit the top part, the upper part. Yes. The, okay. So then she gets up. Is the is the stuff about do you want to go back to bed or or what? Is that all that true? Does yeah, she yeah. She got back up and she got me put down and I got back. Yeah. Okay. And then the 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 laps. Make the laps. Okay. And I thought she was on a seizure. I didn't think that that but, 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 I thought this one didn't That's not what happened. No. It is. I promise. No, that's not what happened. It is. The doctor said when this injury occurred, she was out. This, she wasn't. This she was back up. I am being completely that's, honest. This, that's not what happened. She wouldn't have been able to talk. That's not what happened. It was, there was a more severe accident that happened that, that just like this accident, you're afraid to tell us for some reason. Okay? I'm not afraid to tell you anything. Well, you were afraid well, to tell us that. Well, because I got through that. that. We got, all right. Lost our we, you know, and we got through that. And we're going to get through this. Get through this. Okay? Okay. Because that, that's, that's what we're doing. Yeah. So, so tell us. That's exactly. That's, that's not what happened. It is. She no. slipped in the. No. Okay, I did not. I she didn't do. fall 12 inches and traumatically bruise her. She falls. To the point her. where they have to cut a piece of her skull off to relieve pressure. That's not what happened. The especially, yeah, especially on a. The bones right here are extremely weak. In order to do that much damage. They're, like they're, weak, they're weak for a reason. Right. No, all of them. They're weak for a reason. Oh. They break because they're like crumple zones in a car. Yeah. That's why they break. No broken bones here. No. Okay? Yeah. That absolutely did not do that. Even the surgeon said that. Okay? So that's not what happened. So tell us what really happened. That's really what happened. No, that's not what happened. We're I beyond that. We're beyond that. I don't know what else to Listen, say. Tell us that she's on top of a toy. Mm -hmm. Okay? And she falls face first. Yeah. The day before. Yeah. Gets up and goes on about her business. She did. She did. Never happened. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. So she, the next day, she falls into a step that's probably this tall, this tall up off the ground. Mm -hmm. She's this tall. That's what foot and first. Yeah. She slipped. Okay. You have kids. Yeah. We have kids. Yeah. yeah. You you really think that her falling twelve inches? Hitting her eye is going to make her brain swell. No, that's what I don't understand. Right, right. because that's not was something more traumatic. Something more. Traumatic. I, I believe you, but I, I did not hurt her. What? Well, we're not saying you hurt her. We're saying you were there for the accident. Yeah, that was okay? the accident. Because that's exactly what happened, and that was not the accident. That's not what did this. We know that without a doubt. Okay, that didn't happen. She has no broken bones in her face. Okay. I mean, this is a common thing to get broken when somebody's head right. falls, okay? That's not broken. Breaks easily to protect your brain. Yeah. Okay? I thought it. Yeah. And there's no broken bone in her face. So that's not what happened. Okay? You know, we've, we've come a long way. We, we, we got past that. Okay? Yeah. You're right there. You're right there. Thank you. Why open the door, doctor? And I slipped on the blanket. So I slipped on her blanket when I opened the door, and we both went down, and she hit that concrete step really hard. Where? On her On her face, yes. I was holding her on the left side. And when I slipped, it hit her side. I actually hit my head on the door coming down, but she smacked her face, her whole, her her head really hard on the concrete step. Okay, and then what happened? We got up. I tried to try to get her to come to, and couch out in the garage, not inside, but she did. When we first walked in, and she said, "Walked out," and she said, "No, you're saying she asked that before." Yeah. Okay. And I fell, and she fell. Where did? Where were you at when you fell? Um, against the door, trying to get. The door, the door opened. I was holding her. The blanket was kind of like falling because he had handed her to me, and I put her down. And I picked her. No, he put her down, and when he walked out the door, I picked her up with the blanket, and it got 
tangled up when I opened up the door. It got tangled and I slipped. So are you on the concrete floor or are you on the step or are you on the top side? I was on getting ready. I was trying to step up to go inside. I lost my balance. The blanket got underneath my foot and we both fell. She smacked her face on that concrete step and I hit the door. And I tried to brace her and myself, but I lost my balance. She hit really hard. Then we, I got up and tried to get her to come to do. I was checking her and I said, yeah, are you okay? Yeah. I didn't say that. Yeah, are you ready to take something? She didn't respond. You were still in the garage, kind of in the doorway? Kind of in the, the, in the doorway. Yeah. Right where I said I was. She didn't want her to be hurt. I thought she was having a seizure. Mm -hmm. I think she was really hurt. Her, her brain was, was going through some trauma. That's what, you know, the brain fights to keep going with. And you got in and try to carry it around with this blanket. I didn't have any clothes on under my room, and I was like... <laughs> and then he was just like waiting for us. I didn't know that I hurry. So, so why would you hide that? Because I didn't want to be in trouble. I, mean, why would you I don't know, because I have babies that kids at home. I don't want my husband to get sued. I don't know I can't want to get kids anymore. I don't want to be yelled at with him. Or, I don't know. I just, I'm a goody two-shoes. I've never been in trouble. I've never done anything bad in my life. I would never hurt a kid. I didn't. She was that hurt. I don't know, she was just having a seizure, and I even like turned her on her side and did the mouth thing. How long did you try to get her to come to before you uh, called her dad? I mean, like, not even two seconds. I mean, it was immediate. Immediate, but I knew, I mean, I knew something was wrong. I, I thought it was a seizure, like I said. So I called him and I said, she's not, she collapsed. But I didn't think that I hurt a kid. Because I slept really hard. I actually tried to catch myself in her at the same time, and I bruised my hand right here. <coughs> Alright, we really appreciate it. I'm so sorry. <clears throat> Did the vapor rub and the salt, and I even did my essential oils, and mm -hmm. yeah. 
Yeah, I'm sure there is. Right. Do you know if DNA will survive petroleum jelly? No idea. No idea. Back to under the chin here. Mm -hmm. This absolutely did not happen from a fall on a flat driveway. No. Okay? Yeah. I believe you. Okay. Uh, so what happened to her neck? I do not know. I, I thought it was the grapple and the fall. Yeah, we remember we went through this, and you told us how you agreed with us that some of this stuff. Yeah, was of course. Okay. Yeah. So it's the exact same size as the fresh ones, and they look very similar. Mm -hmm. So either as she fell on, the, on that very same gravel a couple of times, different stages. It could be. Or, I mean, we had gravel at his house too. Okay. So you said, remember you said that he had just put this new he did. gravel on the He just the finished the barn. Okay. And, yep. So it well, being they, the same. They do the gravel a lot. Okay. Of but, the I mean, this, you know, you, you said that these are different stages of healing, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Tell us about those. I think you know about these two. Yeah. I don't know about this. I think you do. I don't. I honestly don't. I'm positive you do. Why would you think I know about them? Because you just lied to us. How, how many times? Well, you are. We can't tell you how many times it tells how she found out what happened in the fall. Okay? Can you and see we, how that doesn't look good? Yeah. If we understand, you call for help. Okay? We're not getting mad at you or anything. We just want to know what happened. We want to know everything happened. We want to know how that happened. We want to know how that happened. We want yeah. to know how the fingers, the, you know, these things happen. Um, we're getting calls from all these doctors yeah. saying, no, 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 and we're saying, yeah, that's the same. No. Yeah. That's what it does. That's not what's going on. This morning, you know, the doctors called and said, you know, tell us what happened when, when you were being told. Yeah. And the said, no. I don't know. Okay. I really, I don't know anything about that. I really and, don't. And, and here's another thing, okay? Mm -hmm. Dad, obviously, every time she comes home with a new scrape or bruise, mm -hmm. Dad asks her, what happened? Yeah. I know you told him. Yeah. But he's doing what any other dad would say. Of course. So what is she telling dad whenever he says, what happened here? What happened there? What happened here? What's, what's the one word or one thing she was saying? I don't know. Baby said her. And even the lady, who, who else did it? Who else watches her? Sandy. She asked, and she asked, who did where, it? where is the girl? Where are you getting all this where stuff? Where are you getting these babysitters? So now we've got. At the babysitter's so look, I wouldn't. Right. I don't. I mean, Can, I don't even. Let me ask you this. I, earlier today, I heard. Did, did you go to college? Yeah. Okay. What did you go to college for? Uh, teaching. Teaching. Did you get to teach? <laughs> no, my dad owns a trucking company, so I stayed on as his okay. secretary. Okay. And, like I said, but I did teach preschool and okay. daycare. Like, and I saw a, a slice of your life this morning at 9 a.m. Yeah. Kids screaming. Mm -hmm. You know, it's loud. Yeah, it's Things get very happy. loud. Okay. Are you ever mad at the way that turned out? No, I love, I love. Things. I'm not saying you don't love your kids. No, no, no. Yeah, no. But do you ever wish? I mean, you went to college to teach. Yeah. No, I don't. I want to be home with my kids. That's I mean, why I'm here. That's why I want to be with TJ because okay. he wanted. A mom to stay home with kids. Okay. Yeah. Do you yeah. ever, have you ever lost it? Did you ever get mad? Yeah. I mean, I yell, I, I yell at TJ. <laughs> I yell at TJ. 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 I yell at I have plenty of them, I don't mean like I'm but like not anything. Remember when we talked about this? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, a lot of these are consistent with what we've seen before. Okay. With kids being hurt. Yeah. Not by falls. Not by running into things. Okay. This is not her fault on travel. Okay. This is not her fault in her yeah. plastic toy. Okay. okay. There are reasons that she has all these. Okay. 
And I, we think you know why she has them. Listen, Hannah has been abused. No doubt about it. And it's not her father. Have you grabbed her ears? Yeah, probably. What do you mean, probably? I've never, no, I don't, I don't grab, I know, I don't have a hamper. Listen, you, you are at home for 12 plus hours a day with a kid that's not yours and three other ones. You cannot tell me <laughs> that does that does yeah. not drive you bonkers. I mean, yeah. I don't know if it's a rage. Like, All it takes is, that, that's, the, that's the only thing that can explain All it. All it takes is one or two. A fit of rage. If you lost your temper, you lost your temper. It's not like you're, these kids come over so you can hurt them. I don't, we don't think that. I'm sitting here demented okay. woman who's just like, yeah, but they're over here so I can beat the shit out of her. Yeah. It's not what we're saying. No. A fit of rage. Okay. And, and that's what's done this. What's going on here? Tell us about it. You've been honest with us so far. Yeah. Why stop? Tell us about it. Oh. Whatever you're thinking, just speak it. I really don't know what to say. Start, start with these. How did you get here? I didn't do that. I don't know. Okay. I really didn't do that. I don't How know. How does this happen? I slapped her upside the head. With what? My hand. Open, close? Yeah, open. Well, what, what caused that? She took all of the, I don't know why she was in trouble, she took all the ketchup out and squirted it into the toilet while I wasn't looking. That's frustrating. And I'm like, yeah. 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 What else had she done that day? Is this like a culmination of things building up? She did. What day was that? Yeah. This week? week? This week? This week? Early yeah. this week? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And I didn't think that hurt her. I really didn't. Well, I think not. I mean, kids are tough. They're not, you know, they're, they, trust me, you know, yeah. as well as anybody else does, you're very resilient and, and you're not, and you're not going to know. Tell us what that was. Chin. I did, I don't, I really did not hit her on the chin. I don't know. saying anything. Right, yeah, I don't. Does she talk back to you? No. She doesn't? Not one bit. Does she not listen to you? Like, is she, if she, she actually does listen. If she's watching she's a listening. show and you tell her to do something, does she not listen? That's you get, how do you get her attention when she doesn't listen? And I've got to listen to Buddy. Does she know you well? No, she eats great. She eats all day long. Then tell us what happened here. Tell us about that. This was not a fall in the driveway. It's not. We know what this is consistent with. Yeah. Look at me. We do this for a living. No, I know. Okay? I know. This is not the first three-year-old that we're staring pictures about, okay? We know exactly what caused this, okay? Exactly. It's not a fall. And you know what caused this. Just like you knew what caused this. Okay? Well, so what caused this? I smacked her on the chin for doing it. That was the same thing. Right. So this is the same incident. Yeah. Tell us about this. Because this is not a smack. I just want to tell you right now. This is not a deep bone contusion from an open handed smack. Okay? Knowing that. I didn't. No, I listen, listen, listen. Like listen. That. Knowing that we know that. What happened here? The same thing. It was the same incident. Tell us, though, what happened to this Wait, with these specific bruises. When she, looked, I caught her doing the ketchup, you know, I took it away, and I put her on the body, because I think she had to go pee anyway. I said, Hannah, you can't do the ketchup. I, I, I just slapped her on the side of the head and went like that. Close? Yeah, like that. How many times? Don't say once. Because yeah. it could slip bruise. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, does he give you permission to, to discipline? Yeah. I mean, spank and stuff? Okay. Yeah. I don't really spank. I don't yeah. even know why I was mad about that. So these were close fists like uppercuts? Yeah. Okay. And this was an open handed smack? Was it really open handed? Yeah. Yes. Okay. All right. Now, the bruises on the chest. Honestly, listen, listen. Now I believe you. Do you see the pattern here? Yes. Deny, deny, deny. How about this right one down here? 
I did not touch her chest. I'm definitely telling you the most positive truth. I did not touch her chest. Okay. So look, but I wasn't mad at that. Let's, 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 let's look at this. Okay. Well, we also, oh, sorry to interrupt. We, we also know exactly what these are. Yeah. They're, in all these cases, they're consistent. I mean, you can literally take 100 of them and put them up on the board right here, and they're all going to have the same exact bruises. And anyone who knows what they're talking about and what they're looking at will say, this is this, this is this, this is this, this is this. That's up to you, okay? We, we want to know what happened. 